52 here at live in Dublin. These gentlemen need no introduction. Lightweight bout here, 63.5 kilos. A class, five three minute rounds. Local man, Sean Clubber Clancy from Siam Warriors in Cork, faces off against Roy the Rebel Wills from the pit in Perth, Australia. This is where the action really takes off tonight. Both boys, fine-tuned athletes, high-level skill tie boxers at the best. The Rebel and the Clubber. Yeah, this has the makings of fight of the night for me. Five rounds, so a measured start normally. Boys clinching up, just taking their time. Locking on strong. It's not a fast paced start, but that's how they normally will start in these five round battles. Yep, this is the feeling out process. This is throw a shot and see what he does. See where the openings are. But this is the next level of Muay Thai. The Rebel lands a leg kick. Clubber comes back on the inside. Oof, first elbow thrown there. From the Uzi. The left uppercut as Clancy comes in. They love throwing the elbows from the pit. You're going to see a lot of elbow action tonight from those boys. As he lands a beautiful uppercut. Close for the head kick. Great layback from Rebel. Very well measured, and there's that left uppercut elbow again. One thing the Aussies, they, they're going to throw elbows any opportunity, especially the boys, like I said, from the pit. Yeah, sometimes there's that unwritten rule in Thailand where they don't Beautiful throw elbows until later in the fight, but no such rule here. We're going at it right from the word go. So far you can see Roy's eyes just on point. Slipping out of range perfectly and returning. Yeah, the focus is crazy. Focus here. Tries to let back up a cut elbow, clinches up. Both boys fighting extremely well here in the first round. There's that slip back, just lays back on it. Simon, 
as he made his entrance. See, just a little nick on the, uh, just above the left eyebrow of Wills from this first round. As we enter the second, Wills has got that really sharp left body kick that he fires off really quickly. Absolutely. It's, it's technical, has got everything. There's that layback. Good evading counter and there. Blocks, as they clinch up, you see, he puts that knee in the range, blocks him off, spoils it. Yeah, good score as well in Muay Thai. You score your point and then you stop your opponent scoring back. Works in your favor. Clubber goes for his own elbow there. A little sneaky one. Looks like a sweep. Good one, yeah, he tried to reverse it there. Will's just locking his arms up well there. Club is not letting go. He's only got one arm grip there. Not much power in those knees, but you know they're just tapping away. Just racking up a few early points. Watch the sharp kick, there you go. Always does it after the split, and again, that was a good score, that one. From the Australian. Toes just catching face. Eats one back. And Roy returns his own. Lightning quick, these guys, aren't they? It's beautiful to watch at this level where it's just like an absolute chess match. Both gents just working each other out. Full tie rules. That cut's opened up a little bit. Yeah, it's dripping down his face a little now. Not a problem at the moment, but it's in a, it's not in the best area. He won't stop him, I can tell you that much. And he's just cut Clancy on the way in. Absolutely, look at that. Left uppercut elbow, Beautiful. saw that. Sneaky little left uppercut elbow. On the clash every time, the boys love the elbows. That was a great left body kick there, stopping Clancy in his tracks. Straight across the rib cage. Clancy's cut, just bleeding down the nose, which is good. Again, and not also in a dangerous area. Well, we kind of knew this was going to happen. Roy blasts another elbow over the top. It's an elbow exchange here. Clancy loves a war and he comes forward, sometimes walking onto elbows. Is it the rebel? Is it the clubber? Either way. Which knee the bit section there by Roy. I think we're going to be covered in blood by the end of this one. Good kick. It's starting, to, it's starting to pour down the faces. As long as it's not pouring into the eyes and obstructing the vision, it's not a problem. As soon as it starts doing that, it becomes danger of stopping the fight. At the moment, not a problem either of them. Wow, this is really shaping up. <laughs> Absolutely, this is exciting. And then, as you, you know, when you see blood, you know, on, on your opponent, you know, you, you, you taste that blood and you want to go for more. And both boys are bleeding, so both boys are going to be going for the uh, for the open wound and try and open it up and try and cause a stoppage. Well, the cuts people have done a, a great job of cleaning these cuts up. Here on Lion Fight 52 in Dublin. I'm Dave Fensum, I'm joined by Nathan Corbett. We're going to take you through the night's action. And what a beauty this is shaping up to be. Yeah. Sean Clubber Clancy yeah. versus Roy the Rebel Wills. Let's watch for that elbow exchange from the clinch as well. Wills does really well at just popping the elbow as Clancy comes in. Both exchanging good left middle kicks as well. They're landing heavy. The boys tie up. Nice leg locks. Well, they're not running from each other. They're right in front of each other. It's not hard to find where they are. They're standing there ready to bang. There's that left kick from Wills. As they exchange one for one. Clancy just a little bit slow in countering that one. Referee breaks the fighters. I like the way Wills takes two middle kicks. Ring. Two or three middle kicks. Yeah. 
that elbow on the way in. The best way to use that elbow on the left hand is as they're coming in, just flicking it up. Yeah, it's just you're open that cut up you're again. Almost headbutt the elbow. Play hall. That was lovely from Wills. How he stepped forward, really covered the distance to make sure that kick landed. Shows a good understanding of range. Absolutely, Dave. He's using his range well. Just tying him up. Irish corner going crazy here, showing to their man. Clancy's is pushing forward. He knows he needs to come in, but he almost run into a right elbow then. Yeah, you've got to watch against somebody as dangerous as Roy Wills. The Rebel taking the middle of the, the ring once again. Oh, lovely trip there from Clancy. Great, great, great technique. Great sweep. He drops an elbow. Almost a head clash on the way in. The both boys tie up there in the corner and wrap it up. Yeah, all this roughing up is going to be opening those cuts up again in the head. The referee's got a big job on his hands tonight. Cut. Fancy Cut. keeps pushing forward, but he runs into a right rib kick from Rebel. Cutsman have done a great job, you've got to say, of uh, closing these up. Keeping the action going. Be the make or break of a fight of the Cutsman. Very true. Clancy just trying to force the room for an elbow there, but not quite making it. Finish with a smile on his face, old Clancy there. He loves being in there, you know, he lives in Thailand full time, and I'm sure he's loving coming back home and fighting in front of his fans, hometown. And, uh, very good condition. Here we go. Expect that fiery left kick that Rebel just looked to fire, but that right shot was planted very well on the rib cage of Clancy. You can see the Rebel, he's just stepping back to keep that range, keep that distance. No need to rush in using the great weapons. Kicking long. Yeah, Will's using his range very well. Favoring the outside, Clancy favoring the clinch. Trying to close the distance. Oh, Clancy's a journeyman. He's gonna, he's gonna rush in and he's gonna push in every fight. Absolute warrior. There he goes for the head kick. Clancy doesn't know how to step back. <laughs> There's any Irishman, they don't, they don't like to step back. They love a fight. Almost a trip there. That, that, that cuts open up a little bit more, it's bleeding, but I don't think it's going to stop him. Nah, he's still running down the nose. He's just gritting his teeth and smiling at him. Loves the war. Will's picking that body kick nicely here, scoring intelligently in this round. He's fighting very smart. Yeah. That's the thing, we know he's a beast. We know he can have a war. But shouldn't war with a warrior like Clancy, and he's doing the right thing. Stepping off, picking your shots, landing them hard with power to score well. But don't get dragged and into war. kicks from, from Roy is perfect in time. Yeah, lovely. And the thing is, you know, if you're clinching up, it wears you out. You know, you don't want to be getting someone hang off your neck. And it looks easy from the outside for a moment, but five rounds of that, it certainly runs the battery down. Good knees from Clancy in the clinch here. Sometimes he can just be on you and wear you down completely in a fight. Just walks forward, ties you up, knee. It's breaking them down. No, the clinch is no, uh, no hidden thing from the from the boys over in the Oz. I love the clinch work. Good knee there from Wills. You see Wills got a little cut, cut on the side of his eye. He steps in with the right elbow. He's been cut twice now. It's a little dripple, but... Clancy trying to sweep the leg. Knee in the back, good score forces the Rebel to turn. 
Beautiful knee exchange. Yeah, great knees there from both guys. One for one. Good kick on the outside from Wills. And then again, he steps into the center of the ring. Nicely taken position. Yeah, he's fighting smart tonight. He knows that he needs to keep that distance because uh, the clubber just wants to tie him up and he doesn't want to be tied up all night. He move. And Clancy's going to chase his man down. Well, you know one thing for sure, the Clancy's not going to be moving, moving backwards. <laughs> He's going to be marching at home all the way if he can. Fourth round. Three minutes of your lives, gentlemen. Here at Line Fight 52. Final round. My mistake, I thought it was the fourth. I was getting too excited. We're in the fifth already. <laughs> I was watching all the elbows too much, Dave. <laughs> We need more blood. <laughs> Beautiful violence. Oh, great kick in there from the Aussie. As we thought, the pace increases. Needed exchange. It was such a close match. You know, one of the boys has got to shine this round to really take it home. Big, big cross from Rebel. Clancy ties him up again. A little trip attempt from Cobber. Working the knees inside well. And it's hard to explain just how tiring this is. Being in the clinch with somebody, continually hanging on your neck and kneeing you. The anticipation as well, you know. Is the knees coming? Is the elbow coming? Again, good ring craft from Wills. For kick there, spinning elbow attempt. Almost. Not quite landing the point of the elbow. Oh, good left elbow there from Clubber Clancy. Clancy slices one through there on the inside. You can see Royce is trying to cover up, get that range of going, gain and grab the distance. Not gonna win the win the fight from there, so he needs to fight from the range. He knows what he's doing, he's tying him up. Hitting the break. I think he feels like he's up as well. Uh, again, I'm no judge, but I feel like Wills, the, the rebel, is probably a point ahead and knows he just needs to kick and score to take some, this fight on this round. Absolutely, he's been landing some beautiful kicks these past rounds. Clancy knows he's got it to work for. He needs to come forward and push the action. As we enter the Big closing right stages of this fight, a slip. Good uppercut elbow here from Clancy. Answered back by the Rebel. One for one, elbow for elbow. Love this. Oh, the elbow from the Rebel. Uppercut elbow off the back. He means business in this last. Last round. Irish corner screaming for their man to do work. As you hear the music change pace, we're entering the last few seconds, and that is it, ladies and gentlemen. What, what a, about? What a battle! What a battle! The both boys just smile at each other, give each other a hug, and just said yes. It's a hard one to call. I think that uh, the Rebel done a lot more work on the outside. He might have just scraped ahead for the win there, but we'll have to go to the judges to see what the results are. Yeah, again, I never, I never like calling it. It's like the curse of the commentator. Absolutely. But I feel like uh, the Australian, for me, just with the cleaner shots and out working a little bit, I think that's a blue corner win. But again, that's just my opinion, and I'm not the judge. It's over to the judges' scorecards for the official result tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, please show your appreciation for both fighters. After five rounds of action, we go to judges' scorecards. Judge Scott has sorted his out 48-47 Clancy. 
Judge O'Brien is serving as about 50, 45 wills. Judge O'Brien, Judge Fletcher has served as about 49, 48 for your winner by Smith decision. And now, the WBC International My Time Champion, Sean! Please hold your place.